Hi, I'm Andrew, here to talk about the rocket sailboat with trusty sail and paddle. This boat's often compared to a sunfish, but it is so much more. And so today we're going to walk through this boat and talk about some of the differences and some of the advantages to this boat uh, as compared to the traditional sunfish design. First off, the boat is a fiberglass design. It is made in the USA in Rhode Island. It's a very lightweight hull. Uh, as a result of the design and the construction, it only weighs 88 pounds, which makes it a very portable boat. A car top pole, or you can put it in the back of a pickup truck, or easily carry it on a dolly down to a launching site. From there, you'll notice the open cockpit of the boat. Made by Fulcrum Speedworks again, you'll notice their design decal on the interior of the boat, but the open cockpit design enables you to lay down, stow additional gear, take two people comfortably in the boat, um, ultimately providing a lot more utility than you'll find in a traditional sunfish design. In addition to that, the hull itself is actually quite a bit faster. Um, so this boat combined with the lighter weight, the hull design, and then a very large sail, as you'll notice as well, about 20% bigger than a traditional sunfish rig. The boat's able to plane upwind and downwind and of course, earn its name as the rocket. It is a very fast boat, but it is very simple to sail, easy for really the novice and the expert. First, you'll notice this halyard and downhaul plays a uh, single line, plays a dual role. So to raise and lower this mainsail, it's literally just a single line. All we have to do is pull this up, bring this down, and you'll notice that the mainsail is easily dropped stowed into the cockpit. It makes it that easy to be able to use your boat when you want to use it, or ultimately stow it on the beach when you reach your destination as well. When you're ready to bring it back up, again, that single line is all you have to pull. So you'll be tugging on this right here. Run it back through the fair lead, and through the jam cleat. And there we go, ready to sail. Centerboard design on it is very efficient. Also fiberglass, makes it very durable and easy to right the boat. The long design makes it easy to handle. Single sheet to control your mainsail. That's all you have to worry about when you're sailing the boat is this right here. For the purist, we have a single hex ratchet with no cleat. We offer as a, an upgrade a cleating mechanism as well, so you don't have to constantly be handling the main sheet. But you'll find with the amount of power that this boat makes, it's a good idea to hang on to it. From there, this main sheet runs to the back of the boat, where it runs and is actually tied off to the tiller itself. This long purchase makes it easy to bring in the mainsail and control the amount of power that you have. It doesn't affect the steering or handling of the boat because it is still in the center line itself. Combine that with a long tiller extension and you're able to sit far forward on the boat for balance or again, carry additional crew members in the boat and still drive comfortably. The hiking position on the boat is also really comfortable, very wide seating side on the boat itself. Hooking your feet under here allows you to really hike out and control the power of the mainsail. In addition to that, the chine on the side and the broad side of it, when it digs in as the boat leans over, provides a tremendous amount of stability and really easy to use power on the boat itself. All this combined to make a much more high performance boat than the Sunfish, ultimately one that is made here in the United States, in Rhode Island by Fulcrum Speedworks. We're proud to carry it here at Trusty Sail and Paddle. Please feel free to give us a call and ask us any additional questions.